Hey there, today I'm gonna to talk to you guys about this chafing dish for like buffet thing. So now this is a, um, a food warming set. Now it does come with four of these. I'm showing you one because as you can see, it's pretty big. Matter of fact, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you measurements of it right now. Uh, this is like a little over 12, 12 and a half inches uh, in round diameter. So as you can see, it's pretty big. I, I can't really fit four of them in here just to show you guys, but it does come with four complete sets. Um, the other thing is, is the company did send me this product for review, but they want me to show you what it is and kind of how it works. So you get this, this um, base here like this. Um, and over here on this side is you're gonna get, this is a lid holder. So you can put the lid holder there. Now you're gonna get these lids. This is a rubber edged glass lid and it comes with the rubber um, little handles on it so it's going to easy to protect your hands because this food gets warm right uh, and so it's got like a seal on it here you're also going to get um, the uh, gas uh, little thing here this gas holder now it doesn't come with the 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 fuel. Uh, you do need to purchase the fuel extra separately. I did that here to show you. Uh, and that goes right on inside here as well. I'll just do that. And this is a lid. This goes a, a lid on it to, to keep it from, um, you know, burn, and when you want to snuff it out. So um, that's going to go inside there. I'm going to put this to the side. And then we're going to get um, two bowls. It comes with two bowls. It comes with a very deep bowl. It comes with a more shallow bowl. And I thought, great, I can put more food in this. <laughs> no, this is actually for water. So you're going to put this in here first. You're going to put some water in it. So what it does is it's actually going to heat up the water, and the water is going to heat up the food. So it's not going to burn your food. It's not, again, this is not for cooking. This is for keeping things warm if you're having a buffet. Uh, it is almost that time of year where you cook a turkey and have a big family over and that kind of thing. So I'm excited because we're going to use these because we have a lot of people coming over. Uh, so you put that in there. You're going to put water in it. Now, the instructions that I got did not have um, anything that says how much water to put in it. Uh, but you want to make sure that it's, you know, you're going to put this in here. So you want it to sit kind of in some water, but you don't want to put too much where you put this in with food in it and water is going to fly out everywhere. So you got to be careful with that and figure out what is the best amount of water to put in there. Then of course you put this one in here and this is where the food goes into. Um, I think you could probably put um, a, a liner in it of some kind if you want to or a small pan like if you have a, a thing of dish of, uh, of rolls and they're already in a pan you want to put it in there I'm not quite sure but this is this is clean it's a it's the metal on there uh, it's got a nice little surface to it uh, so you can put food right in and it's going to clean up very easily anyways and then of course you put your lid on and again it's got a rubber seal to it so it's going to keep it nice and sealed and then uh, when it comes time for serving you can just pop this up and we're going to put it right down here into the lid holder so you can get your food without having a place to to put your lid because you know if you've got all kinds of stuff set up on a table you don't have room for no lids but you want to be able to have a lid nearby to put it on here to keep things warm. Okay, on the lid, I just noticed what it says here because I didn't have my glasses on. Um, to open it, we're gonna flip it to the right and that's what opens up this part of it here. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this over the top all right now. And I'm gonna open it up to expose. Here we go, hopefully you can see that. Expose the fuel. Let's go ahead and light it. It doesn't take much, it just takes a little flame. Now, it's kind of hard to see the flame sometimes. Now, I can see it, so you gotta be careful. It is on, it's, it's that uh, uh, gel type fuel. Uh, I filled this up here about halfway. So we got halfway. He's gonna put that up there. And then I'm just going to, uh, well, we'll go ahead and put this one in. I did wash this pan. Looks like it is gonna be okay there. And we're gonna put this up here like that and I'm gonna go ahead and let it heat up for a little bit and then that uh, will put some food in it and come back and show you what that's like okay I had the burner on here uh, for a little while probably about 15 minutes or so longer than you ever need to because I was busy doing some other things now I don't really have food in here yet I didn't have anything I could really put a, a quantity of food in here but I wanted to show you I have a, a little uh, temperature gun here and I'm gonna hit it and show you it, this right now is 164 degrees. I don't know if you can if you can see that, but it's 164 degrees, 165. It's going to vary a little bit, 160, um, right into the pan itself. Uh, so so we know. 
the um, the water is going to be very hot too. Let's see if I can. I don't know if I want to try this or not here. Let's see if I can take this out. So let's go ahead and hit the water. 162, 163, 165. So about the same there. So you can see that this does get really hot. You could, uh, like I said before, it's not really designed to cook anything, but you probably could over a period of time is really cook it. So it, it does keep it nice and warm. Now what you do is once, it, once it's warmed up, you don't have to keep the flame on it all the time because now this water is good and hot. It's gonna stay good and hot for a long time. So I'm gonna go ahead and push this over. And that should douse the flame. That little, I, what I did, I just, I just closed the little lid thing here to it. It's gonna take the flame off. Now remember, this is gonna be a nice 165 degree water temperature that is gonna keep your food warm for a really, really long time. Uh, so really cool, again, you get four of these if you are looking for a nice way to keep a lot of food warm for holidays, buffets, events, things like that. This might be the right thing for you.